Hi, my name is Brandy, and I was chosen as a finalist for Shumura's Beauty Art Makeup Competition. I am really excited to share with you the look that I created based on Cherry Blossom Beauty. I hope you like it and have fun recreating it. Check it out! <laughs> I prepped the skin with Shumura Stage Performer to add moisture and glow. Also, doubling as a concealer and foundation, I used the Nobara Cream Cover Stick to correct and even out the skin tone. I started the eyes by applying the beigey pink cream eyeshadow from the Sunset Gold Palette as a base for the eyeshadow to stick to, as well as to provide a nice sheen. Continuing, I've covered the whole eyelid and all the way up to the brow with the lighter pink from the Dreamy Petals Palette. Next, place the brighter pink from the same palette onto the eyelid. To create some shape and depth, take the bronzy brown from the Dreamy Petals palette and blend it into the crease of the eye. When you've finished, move on with the same color to the lash line. With the red cream in the palette, blend from the outer corner of the eyelid towards the middle. Layered on top of the other eyeshadows already on the eye, this comes out as a nice springy hot pink. Using the beautiful gold in the palette, blend from the center of the eyelid where the pink stops towards the inner corner of the eye. This does a great job of replicating the nice yellow found in the center of a lot of cherry blossoms. Next, I've lined the eye with the black cream liner again from the Dreamy Petals palette. Going back with the brownie bronze you used before, blend along the bottom lash line. Always prep and curl your eyelash with the Shuomura's eyelash curler. Apply Shuomura's Ultimate Expression Mascara to your freshly curled lashes to add length and volume. Use the peachy blush from the Sunset Gold palette. Blend from above the cheekbone and down onto it. This adds a little bit of drama, but still keeps it fun, girly, and fresh for spring. Line and fill on the lips with a new bit of Paint on your lipstick using the peachy pink color from Shuomura's Sakura Collection. Finish your lips by painting on Gloss Unlimited to add a lasting shine. I'm applying Shuomura's Pink Partial Floral Feather Lashes to the outside corners of the eye to add some flair. To apply your lashes, use a small amount of Shu's eyelash adhesive on the eyelash strip, wait a few seconds for it to get tacky, and press it up against the eyelash line where you want to place it. You have a few seconds to get it right before it dries. You can even use the eyelash curler to pinch your eyelashes and the falsies together for a lasting effect. Finally, for some creativity and fun, I've decided to recreate cherry blossom branches on the face. I've done so by using various shades of pink pencils, as well as cream-based eyeliners, to paint on and draw on the look. I hope you've enjoyed and will have fun recreating this look on your own. Thanks for watching!